And we got this started, Sharice, because you and I were talking about urbanism and urban planning. That's kind of kind of your happy place. Um, do you want to define a little bit of what you consider urban? I I consider cities urban. I, I don't. I know that some people consider you know, uh, demographics that make a place urban, you know, more minorities. I go by the genuine definition of what is urban. It's a city. Um, it's a city with, it's usually varied in its demographic and then um, housing and, and modes of transportation. But at the end of the day, you know, the same definition you derive from a city or a major metropolis, I guess, to be more defined. That's what I consider. Right. And um, I think I would agree with that definition, but I also think about um, here we are in Central Virginia and uh, we've got Charlottesville as a nucleus, but then we also have other urbanizing communities. Um, Charlottesville's got a, a growth area, it's Albemarle County rather, has a growth area called Crozet, and that's um, starting to bring back some of the density that it once had when it had more of a manufacturing base. Um, and then I think about um, some other villages and towns in the central Virginia area. But it's interesting to think about Virginia in general because there are a lot of communities in Virginia that are really more rural with um, a smaller urban center. So do you think transit would be a factor? Oh well, yeah, that's why I said with different multimodal um, opportunities, I guess would be the best word, you know, uh, bus system, cars, uh, not even like vehicles, but sidewalks, um, lots of them. Um, bicycling, yeah. Yeah, bicycle yeah. lanes. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I, I think that all adds to making a place urban, making transit um, more, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Adaptable is not the word, but more accessible. Accessible, yeah. More accessible. Yep. Um, that ties into being urban.